Welcome to the 2014 Best Bass Tournament Circuits Tournament of Champions. Giving away cash and prizes valued at over $75,000. The BBT is all about family fun, long lasting friendships, and most of all, it's about allowing the beginning angler to compete for big cash and big prizes in events just like this. Our circuits are held on some of the most productive bodies of water in California. This TOC was on the California Delta with calm weather on day one and winds up to 30 miles per hour on day two. Anglers of all ages and gender, big boats, small boats, enjoyed this event. We hope you enjoy the summary of the 2014 BBT TOC event which will include interviews with our top anglers from the event. For more information on this event or future events that the BBT has in California, go to www.bestbasstournaments.com. Who are you fishing with? My dad. We're gonna weigh a big fish. He said he's gonna weigh a big fish. Wow, who caught that fish? You did. Okay, hold on. <laughs> wow, who netted that fish? I did. Nice job. <laughs> Dude, Way you, you got to come over here and talk to me about this sack. You had 19 pounds yesterday, didn't you? We had 19 yesterday, and I'm guessing we're about the same today. This is a beautiful sack right here, guys. Big fish. That's, that's a big fish, and there's like three of them all that same size in there. I mean, they're close. Now, you can tell us now, because we'll listen. Come over here. How did you catch them? Uh, we caught most of them punching. 2066, give this man a round of applause. He backed it up and beat the weight from 19 plus pounds yesterday. He's in the hunt for $20,000. Put, grab a two of those big fish and hold them up, guy. Day two, backs it up, 19 pounds, comes back and he weighs 20 pounds plus. Look at this, give this man a round of applause if you would. 1021. Now, we're not playing any game here. It wasn't a hockey game, so there's no score. There's weight. You guys can understand the verbiage here. Congratulations on that fish. 1367. 1367. I want to ask this question. They want to know, what did you catch that monster on? A jig. Quarter ounce jig. Black, with black and blue. Uh, probably about three feet. Three feet, grab a hold of that big fish. We want to get a great picture of that John Momus. That's a good old big one or a big old good one. I don't care how you, we're gonna look that way. Take a look at that, look at that fish right there. That is a enormous fish. Watch out, that little kid's gonna go over here. That fish will eat that kid. I don't think so, but it can hit out Be close, grab a hold of that big fish. I want you to walk up here, I want to get a nice picture. That fish is a Lunker Club fish. Any fish over seven pounds caught in a BBT tournament, here's a Lunker Club fish. 692 for a big fish. How'd you catch that big fish? You can tell us now. Ah, there you go. He had 15 plus less yesterday. We're gonna add to it. He said he got bigger. Wow, look at that, ladies and gentlemen. 20 pounds, 0.26. Give the sponsors a round of applause. You cannot do this without sponsors. Without them, guys, I'm gonna factor all this out because it kept coming today. It just kept coming. I was like, holy smokes. And, and one of the guys goes, you know, you probably got over 20 grand here. And I started going, shh, 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 shh. oh yeah. We got over $20,000. I'll have it all up on the website of every prize that was won. That's what that lady is doing. She's writing all the prizes down and we will support our sponsors by letting know who won all those prizes. We have a target weight at a lot of our tournaments. And what we did was we came up with a target weight. The target weight was was? 17-5-0. Whoever was the closest without going over would win that. I'm sure giving you guys the hat. And I'm giving you an HD 7 touch. Oh, I need that. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I lost a finger in that deal. Congratulations. I'm glad you, glad you guys came out here to the BBT oh, TLC. You're loving it? You're loving it? Oh, yeah. It's the best Congratulations. Thank you for saying that. I'll tell you what, Lorenz done a solid. That's an HD Gen 2 7 touch. You had the smallest limit 
added together and you just want a unit that costs a lot more money than the entry fee. Congratulations from the town of Lawrence, because that's the big town. Congratulations on your fish. You're smaller, you can hold it better. I want to shake your hand. Shake your hand. Congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, give a round of applause if you would. I'm so happy I stuck around. <laughs> this is the only thing I won all weekend. Thanks, everyone. Brand new 2014 Veritas. I appreciate it. Thank you very Thank much you, again, Cameron. sir. Thank you. You're getting them today, bud. I am. <laughs> This TV has been donated courtesy of Republic Electric. Boat number 81, are you here? A flash screen, he needs help carrying that. Oh. One, just one, just one. Glenn, it's good to see you. We got a Berkeley power bait tackle. 118. A Lorance HDS7 for a receipt. $20 bill. I got a beautiful big fish trophy. This guy brought in a pig. 10 pounds, 0.25. That's right. I think he had two other fish to go with that fish. Big fish of the tournament. I think William caught that fish. That's right. Come on down. Did you catch that fish? Did you catch that fish? Come on down here, brother man. Give this round a round of applause, who win? As well. He gets the illustrious Big Fish Trophy. The Big Fish Trophy. I want you to hold that Big Trip Fish Trophy. I want you to show right in that camera and see that young lady right there. And guess what? You get $695. Now, guess what I'm going to do? I want to find out how you caught that Big Fish. Uh, yeah, I caught it off a jig. Uh, there's this redneck guy I know in East Tennessee, and he makes his own jigs. They're quarter ounce jigs, black, with a uh, black and blue chunk. And uh, this guy, Joe Paul West, because you know if you're in the South, you have to, you know, have two names, Joe Paul. So um, I'm hearing you. Oh yeah. So he, uh, you know, he he supplies all the jigs, and uh, he's pretty awesome. So I mean, for a dozen jigs, you get them for like I don't know, twelve seventy five or something. So he doesn't really understand what the market value is anymore. So. Cut, cut what he's doing, he's selling you jigs. Oh, oh yeah, he, he he deals with too much lead. But I mean, it's no big deal. Oh my <laughs> but I like some lead. <laughs> I'm, I'm liking this fishing. Um, six nine six hundred ninety five dollars. And how deep of water is that fishing? Uh, probably about three or four feet on a wind blown bank. On a wind blown bank, six hundred ninety five dollars on a wind blown bank on a quarter ounce jig. I don't know very many people to shoot out there with a quarter ounce weight. I don't even think I own a quarter ounce jig. Congratulations on that big fish. Give this man a round of applause. 10.25 pounds. Christopher LaPointe, Marcus Warner, are you guys still around? Come on down, just out of the money. I have some Berkeley bags. I've got some Berkeley line. I've got some Timber Tigers. I've got, oh, I've got some good stuff in that bag, dude. I'm telling you what, you had a great weekend, didn't you? Oh, yeah. We had a great turn weekend. around, oh, turn around. We, we camped here. We hung out with everyone, had a good time. It was a wonderful blast time. Just drinking beers, fishing, camping, grilling. You know. What were you grilling? That's important to me. T-bone, hamburgers, hot links, you name it. He didn't win any money, so it's back to hot links and <laughs> the T-bones are out. Baloney, probably. <laughs> spam. Spam. Great day yesterday, tough day today. What was your day all about? Uh, motor issues, trolling motor issues, you name it. If you were, were going to sum up your day fishing with this guy, what would you say your best thing was fishing with this guy? What would you be your sum up? I'd have to say the best time was the three and a three quarter pounder was heading over the boat, the hook came out, and he grabbed the net at the last second and snared it. <laughs> In the air. In the air. Gotta love that. That story. Well, I've got some Berkeley bags and some Berkeley products, and I got some of our sponsors, Timber Tigers, and some other space. Appreciate you guys coming out. Thank you guys very much.
Well, you know what? You had a great day. You had 13, 13 the first day, 15, 19. That kid is 13 years old. They had 28, 32. They had 500, 40, 60, 100, 205, $905 for ninth place. Come up here, guys. I got to talk to you. You're, you, you are fishing with uh, this guy, supposedly without the uh, test that you'll be taking later on when you get older. It's your dad. How old are you? Thirteen. <laughs> that, <one. laughs> that was quick. That's quick, man. <laughs> Son's like the boy. See, that's what happens. Let me explain taxes to you. In California, what happens is somebody, you worked hard today. And you worked hard yesterday, correct? Yes. And then when you made that money, mm -hmm. the guy who actually paid the bill. Him. Collected that money. Ask him what his point is. What the sucks. It does. <laughs> Welcome to California. <laughs> Always working for the man. <laughs> Back of a shirt. The anchors management. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, so you're fishing with your dad. That's awesome. So, what is the best thing about fishing with your dad? We get along and we don't fight all day, so like it's a good time. Nice. Yeah. Right on. That's awesome. <laughs> you know what? Here, what, tell these guys what your name is. So my name's Sean Milligan. And you're fishing with your son. I bet everybody here wants to give you the biggest round of applause because you're fishing with your son, keep him in the business, keeping this thing going. Give a round of applause. Thank you. <laughs> you hear that? Thank you. In eighth place. They're both good looking, which really upsets me. They went 500, 40, 70, 115, 260, $985. They weighed 1909 the first day. They caught 924 today, 2833. Where are the birches? Are you guys still here? Now, I was going to ask you the same question, and he said that they don't fight. And that was dad and son. How are you guys? I'm not even going to ask you. How is it fishing with your wife? It's wonderful. It's a blessing. There are a couple little, like, she got a backlash. Like, oh, nothing. Just powerful. Get, you know, get to it and just deal with it. Yeah. Yesterday was great because she got that big fish. And that was awesome. She's like, get the net. This one's coming in. And almost took her in the toolie. She's like, no, it's coming back. She got it out and she's like, it's out of the toolies. It's in deep water. Just bring it in now. And we went back to the same stuff today. And this place is so humbling. I can tell you that. We launched a big break is where I keep my boat. I'm going to fish a popper all the way back tonight because it's glass if you go out in the levee now. And we were fishing in three footers, and it's like, well, we could be in Lake Erie. It could be worse. I mean, you know, water coming over the bow, and we just kept fishing, and we used heavier weights. We caught 40 fish today. Our big fish left. I don't know where they went. And who knows? Under the lake. Under the lake, yeah. You fishing with your husband. How did that go down? Went great. He's a great teacher. I never fished until I met him. <laughs> How sweet. <laughs> you, didn't, you weren't a fisher person? Congratulations. Give this, this couple a round of applause if you would. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, dude. I got some more money. I got seventh place. This team had 1194. They had 1753. They also had a bigger fish. They had a big one. Second big fish of the tournament. Eight. 18 for the second day. This is how their money went. They got 650, 80, 130, 310, 410, 50. $1,580. Give a round of applause for Chris Lanou. Lynn, are you guys still around? Leanne. Leanne, sorry, thank you. Oh, he's going to talk. You're going to get the money, huh? See, Americans got talent had a, a guy that was a magician. He won it this year. I could have won it because I just lost that money. <laughs> How was your day today with this young lady here? 
Well, with this wind, uh, the good Lord was definitely looking down on us because it was a grind. Um, we just dug in and fished our guts out and uh, we got that big fish that made all the difference in the world. Well, it was a nice fish. I congratulate you on your guys. And did you net that big fish? I netted it, absolutely. Were you nervous? Absolutely. Jabbed and at it the whole way. You jabbed at it the whole way. Nice. Now, did you catch any of the fish throughout the day? Because I know he's not going to let you know that. Congratulations. I appreciate you. I was going to ask you if you caught any fish, but I thought I'd ask her because she was going to tell me the truth. Women don't lie. Men lie on bass fishing. Sixth place. This team had a good, good amount of weight just to get in sixth place. They had 12, 54. Their big fish the first day was 530. They had 1699. Their big fish was 558. They had a total weight of 2953. This team won 700. 60, 130, 150, 360, 1400 dollars for sixth place. Give a round of applause if we went for Larry and Jim. Hutton, Griffin, come on down. <laughs> Tell me about your day. Uh, changed up our game plan completely. Uh, we went to Discovery Bay all day and got out of the wind, threw jigs all day, and just got a couple good ones to go. Appreciate that, appreciate that. And fishing with the guy on your left, I know that uh, he's uh, vertically challenged, but uh, how did you do with him? Uh, he was a good net man today. Mm -hmm. he, uh, I needed him today, so actually all weekend I needed him, so it was good to have him around. Yeah, yeah, true. That's good to be a, it's good to be a team. Oh, this time was a team. <laughs> That's good talking right there. Thank you guys very much. I appreciate you coming out here to BBT TOC talking and explaining and they have to stick around for some more pictures top five don't get to go home this is where the money goes way up they had 1674 13 pounds the second day they had of uh, five fish limit on both days they had 2974 this is how their money went they had $1,000 110 230 300 465 a total of 2105 Give a round of applause for Troy Fleming and Casey Rhymes. Congratulations, guys. Come over here. One stand on one side of me, one stand on the other side, because I, I want to I wanna do this right. Numbers look good? Looks perfect. How was your day today, guy? Uh, kind of slow. Uh, we turned it around and ended up catching 13 pounds. Uh, the wind, the wind blew our blew our mat out that we were hoping that would be there, and but that's fishing. So that's all you can ask. How many fish you guys catch all day today? I'd say about oh, and two? 20. Yeah, about 20 fish. How do you think about the flies that are all over our lake right now? They're great. They're lots of fun. I appreciate that. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, give a round of applause for your fifth place team. <laughs> nice job, guys. Always have a smile. I've never seen this man without a smile on his face. You say anything, the man smiles. When he comes up here, if I say one word, it don't matter what the word is, the man will smile. He had 16.53 the first day, 16.91 the second day. He had 33.44 his total weight. His partner, Clint. And Albany, come on down, if you would, please. Ladies, the word disqualified. By the word disqualified. Say the word. Disqualified. Come over here. There you go. Okay, seriously, come over here. Take a look. Let's get ready. Seriously, let's talk about this. What I tell you? <laughs> Come here, bro. Come here, my good man. Come here. How is it fishing with this guy right here? Oh, it's comedy. It's a good time every time. When we're getting them, when we're not. We always have fun. Because when you guys come in, he starts smiling, then you start smiling. So I know it's a good team when you guys are just having a good time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All the time. So, how'd you catch your fish? Luck. Okay. I've got uh, I've got money in my hand, and I ain't uh, lucky. Lucky, okay, 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 okay. Let's talk about another position over here. Okay. Well, I went out earlier this week, and uh, 
Not on Monday or Tuesday, correct? No, no, no. no. During the practice time. Did a lot of flipping. Um, did pretty good. It was a lot of Hyacin in the water. Uh, game time came. Hyacin kind of cleared out the way. We was able to get back into our spots. Flipped and punched majority of the day. Um, had a good fish on day one, but a lot of a lot of rats to go along with it. So we were looking for a big fish on day one. It didn't happen. A, a second big fish, it didn't happen. So day two, we was like, well, if we can get a big fish again, we might do good. We got all solids on day two today and no big fish. And, you know, that, that's the delta. You know, you get them, you don't get them. That's just how it goes. So we wanted it bad. I mean, we, we fished our heart out. I don't think we sat down or took a break both days. And, uh, you know, hats off to the guys that won it. So... I know he says he caught a fish. Did you catch? How'd your day go? He, he caught the big fish yesterday. Um, I caught m majority of the solids today, so it kind of goes hand in hand. You know? Good. That's, that's, that's how we do it. Yeah. yeah. And then when we both do good in one day, we win magic happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What was the type of uh, terrain that you were fishing? Uh, like we said, mats basically mostly flipping. Yes, yeah, flipping thick, high ascent, floating vegetation, whatever weeds, a bunch of different things. Excellent. Well, they, everybody here wants to congratulate you. We're going to watch you guys and stick around for some more pictures and stuff like that. Take that money. You got $2,830. You got to love that. Guys, appreciate that, huh? They had $1,666. They backed it up with $1,847. They had $3513 for third place. This is how their money went $1,500, $300, $620, $910. 11.35 for third place, 4,465 dollars. Give a round of applause for Nick and Ryan. Come on down. All right, I gotta hear some lies, but I want them all truth. I want you to look at that camera and you're not going to tell us anything that's wrong. Tell me how you caught your fish. Uh, mainly caught them punching and top water. How many fish do you guys catch on top water? Uh, in a couple days, probably maybe six. What type of locations and waters were you fishing to catch your top water fish? Uh, fishing maybe two to six feet of water um, around weeds. Current. And current. The weeds, uh, I don't know what that area is at, but. Uh, Weeds, huh? Rocks and weeds? Uh, Tulies and weeds. Thank you. And uh, was, it was near current, okay. And exactly the spot you were fishing, was there other things that you did other than the top water baits? We punched. In that same region? In the same area. Yeah. Awesome, awesome, that's good to know. So, how many fish you guys catch all day, in both days total? You know, we really struggled both days. We thought we were gonna do a lot better than we did. And, uh, we caught some small ones in some of the areas, but where the quality fish were, we maybe caught eight fish a day. Awesome. Maybe. Well, maybe eight fish a day? Yeah. Right eight fish. Yeah, no, they were good ones, but we, we were hoping for some bigger ones. We had a few mishaps. That might have pushed higher. We had a few big ones come off. That's what punching, that's what happens, or big topwater fish. I got $4,465 for you guys. Who wants it? Dar. Give it to him. Nice. You guys are not even married. You just money to you, bro. That's awesome. Congratulations, guys. Second place team. They had 1572, and on the second day, they backed it up with 2026. They had a 692 for the big fish. They had 3598. This is how their money went down. 280, 2000. Man, that's awesome. 480, 970. 1525, 1600 for third place. Give a round of applause if you would for 6855. Albert Douglas, come on down. Third place money, second place in a tournament. You gotta love it. Gotta love it. About time. About time. All right, talk to me. Now, don't be lying, because you guys had a great bag. Come over here. Don't be walking away. Now, turn around that face that way. Who was? Is that what your position was? <laughs> yeah, that was my position. He tore him up. <laughs> he tore him up good. 
<laughs> Dude, that's awesome. <laughs> Where are you guys from? West Ham. And he talks like that? Oh, yeah. Well, actually, I live right next door. He's originally from Minnesota. Okay, I knew you had the accent. I didn't know where from because I'm not from there. So. How did you catch a fish? Punch it. Caught him, punch him. Yep. Paycheck, punch bait. And how many fish did he catch all day? Today, he probably caught 25. And I caught about eight. And I think one of mine stayed in the bag. One of yours stayed in the bag. And what, you know, you're fishing. What type of material are you fishing? Are you fishing? What kind of a cover? I punch in, punch in the weeds. I didn't punch it into the bank. Just a bunch of grass. Are you uh, grass or the highest or you, uh, all kind of stuff? All anything. anything. Okay. Well, like I said, I wait for the tide. You know, getting your watch until the tide turns. I want to turn and went the right way. Everything was exposed, and I just punch in those pockets in there. Oh. That's just a, that easy. It was, it was easy. It was that easy. For it was that easy. For <laughs> all these guys are like. Why are they all, there's these fingers that they're waving. What the, <laughs> easy, they're all beat to death, they're tired. Again, the secret is you gotta have ounce and a half to two ounce punch weight. Uh, you gotta have big weight, I mean, big ounce. Like, I don't think it matters here. If they're gonna eat, they're gonna eat. Whether it's 12 inches or five pounds, they'll eat the two ounce sinker or three ounce sinker, they'll eat it. Wow, that's awesome, guys. Well, I got 68.55 for you. Here you go, congratulations. Congratulations. I got two nice plaques right behind you. They weighed 1944 on the first day. They weighed 2066 on the second day. Their total weight was 40, 10. I got 20 grand right here. I'm not waiting for something to arrive into later on in life. It's right here in my hand. BBT gives the biggest payback of any team circuit right here and now. This team that's gonna get this money with 40-10, I got Meeks and Short. Come on down, Damon J. I talked to a team earlier this week. They said, if we fish the Delta or Clerlick next year, we're not fishing because we don't have a chance. Because we're from the coastal region. This is too far. We can't beat those Delta guys. This is not the team, but where are you guys from? Central Coast. Coastal <laughs> Division, guys. So I've got it even better for you. This is only my second time ever being with the Delta. I'm not lying. Jay brought me up here about a month ago. Uh, we found the same fish that we were on today and this is my second time ever coming to Delta. You gotta love that, guys. <laughs> so what I want to do... I want you to grab that big trophy right there. And I want you to grab that other big trophy right there. And what I want you to do, watch out the top, watch the top. I want you to do this for me. I want you to raise those things over your head like you're the proudest parent in the world. <laughs> Give a round of applause if you want, ladies and gentlemen. 40 pounds plus to win the TLC on the California Delta. These are the guys. That is just plain awesome.
Those trophies are made from a guy out of Manteca. It's called Bass and Moore. If you guys need a big fish, this guy makes some awesome. I need to ask you guys this major question. How did you catch him? I uh, caught one on a uh, chatterbait, and the rest all came punching. So where in the coastal region do you punch? It used to be Margarita, which uh, we don't have much water here anymore. <laughs> so, that, so we don't do it there. So because you fish Nacimento, um, San Antonio when it has water, and then you fish Lopez, and at, with eight pound and four pound test that you fish those lakes, did you have to kind of boost up online? Did you have to buy rods and reels? Because I know you guys probably don't have that equipment in your boat. I bought a punching rod four years ago, and it's been sitting in the shelf. And I dug it out for this tournament, put 80 pound braid on it, and whacked them. <laughs> you did whack them. How many fish you guys catch both days, all total? Uh, a lot. Um, Good answer. Close to 100. What's that? We probably caught close to 100 fish in the two days. Awesome. Yeah, we had a really good time. And may I ask what you guys are punching? Mm, uh, beavers. It mainly came on beavers, some with the punch skirt, some without uh, one to one and a half ounce weights. You know, nothing real, nothing real special. We caught in the morning. We had a good little milk run in the morning. We were running a couple of submerged islands. Uh, I could catch them on a crankbait. You could catch them on a chatterbait. By the time we left those islands every morning, we'd have a smaller limit. Run up north and you could catch a dump load of two pound and under fish, and then just hoping for those four or five, six pound bites. What type, what type of uh, areas were you looking for? When you say you're punching, everybody knows you punch a different kind of cover. What was your specific cover that you guys were winning 20 grand on? Uh, look for the look for the mats that you should be frogging and punch them instead. Are you talking about the cheese? Yep. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. They, uh, we did find some fish in wood. They just, I don't think we weighed in any on there, but we caught quite a few fish off of wood. Um, you know, the, neat, the neatest part, I gotta hand it to my partner on this one. When we're sitting there, you know, I told him I've never been to the Delta before, and so we made reservations to come up and stay at b and I don't know, it's been 15 years since he's been here. And so he gets on Google Earth. And <laughs> lo and behold, I'm not kidding, we won this tournament off of Google Earth. Okay, so we're up there looking around on Google Earth, and he comes to me one afternoon, and he shows me this little tiny uh, dead-end slough. And about halfway back in that dead-end slough, the water got darker on the picture. And he says, I bet you that's a deep hole. So when we came up here a month ago, the first day of practice, we run up there to that deep hole and absolutely knocked the snot out of him. I caught a 10. First day on a Delta that I've ever been to the Delta, and I catch a 10. We caught numerous you know, twos, threes, fours, and fives. Fished a lot more around that area, found a few other things, but that deep hole up in there was really, really special. So my partner gets all the credit on that one, his his state job and sitting there on a computer and looking at Google Earth, <laughs> won us a tournament. He should have done, now look at this, look at him, he's like. <laughs> It's that spot right there. I can see these guys starting to do that. So, you found the spot on Google Earth, and now Google Earth wants their cut. <laughs> It'd be nice, but no. If they sponsor me, it'd be fine. <laughs> I didn't mean to throw your money on the ground, but it is your money. And after the money hits the ground, there's $10,000 in each pile. If you would like that, I would like you to take that, lift it up in the air, from each other this is not like a slam or anything like i just got it out there i wanted you to get it i want you to pick it up and show everybody ladies and gentlemen our champions give a round of applause for these two gentlemen with all of the letters twenty thousand dollars congratulations guys that is what i'm talking about money 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 and a great two guys that caught a lot of fish guys congratulations you guys had 40 pounds, 10 ounces. Give a round of applause if you would for Meeks and Short, Damon and Jay. You know, I got it. Before everybody leaves, I, the first thing I got to do, I've never met Randy before. Uh, Chris and Jennifer run our tournaments. They put on a great tournament. You guys are just, you know, you're doing a very good job in running tournaments. Me and Jay ourselves, we help run a couple of local clubs around there, so we understand the work you guys put into it. 
I just want to say thank you guys. I really, really appreciate it. Well, thank you very much. Well, ladies and gentlemen, give a round of applause. Hey, BDT's out here. Hey, this is Randy Pringle. I'm telling you right now, we just concluded 2014 Tournament of Champion. I got the two anglers that weighed in 40 pounds, 10 ounces on a two-day event when the fishing was as tough, wind condition on the second day, calm the first day. Who am I talking to over here? Jay Short. And? Damon Meeks. And how do you catch all those fish? Uh, we start off in the morning throwing chowder baits and crankbaits, and then we moved up up later in the afternoon, we started uh, uh, punching sweet beavers, some with uh, some with punch skirts, some without on ounce to ounce and a half weights. That is awesome. Let me tell you guys, I'm looking at $20,000 and it's all about the fun of the BBT. But let me tell you, when you're coming out and you're fishing and you get 20 grand sitting in front of you, what did you just hear from your wife? I heard some loud screaming <laughs> and, and a lot of surprise and everything. With the trophies <laughs> that you're looking at right now, where are these trophies going to go? I asked her to find a place, and she said she'd figure it out. <laughs> for, for 20 grand, she's going to find a spot for these two beautiful trophies? Yes. I tell you what, the company that makes these is a, does a great job for the BBT. Bass and more. You know, when you don't want to catch a fish and harm it, you can always make a replica of it. It's always about catch and release. And I got two great anglers, BBT, winning $20,000 here on the California Delta.